Coffee is big business and the baristas or coffee bartenders who make them at trendy coffee shops around the world are growing in flair and creativity. But one man in New York City, Mike Breach, is taking what he calls berry start to the next level. Using an espresso machine, Michael can make big name celebrities and other lifelike objects appear in your cappuccino. This is the best Shakespeare I've ever done. This is all, man. It's ridiculous. I feel like I've met Shakespeare in person after seeing this, this magical coffee that was created. It's such a work of art, I kind of don't want to destroy it. My favorite names for the designs, they usually uh, sprout from puns. Leonardo Di Cappuccino, which I did today. Um, Al Pacino, Chino. Right now I'm steaming the milk. Getting it the right consistency. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Now we're ready to draw. The reactions I usually get from people, it's, it's usually just a very loud gasp or like, oh my god, who did this? Who did this? No way. And they'll immediately pull out their cameras and they'll take a photo. And most people don't expect such an elaborate piece of art to be on something that just is not going to last very long. I get my inspiration for my designs. It sounds funny, but I get a lot of it from Willy Wonka because he just wanted to have fun with food and have fun with what he did. And like I, I've said this before, I think there's just too much seriousness in the coffee world. Wow, this is really cool. I've never seen anything like this before. It's like a 50-50 thing. I kind of don't want it because it looks so pretty, but then you kind of do want to drink a little bit of John Lennon, right? I drink it, eventually. <laughs> As Michael's range of designs grows and he perfects each Barry Star piece, coffee lovers just can't get enough. I'm planning on publishing a book. I want to publish the ultimate coffee table book. I'm actually currently looking for investors and publishers to help me out getting a studio going and get some equipment so I can produce some beautiful art for them and some high quality photos and make a book that's funny and mind-blowing at the same time.